Hey everyone, I am going to try to attempt to show you how I am going to switch out rings from my um, my personal size Filofax. Um, this is like my absolutely favorite planner, but I they I always overstuff them. I mean they're great rings right now, but I want them bigger. So I ordered these off of Amazon. These are the 30 millimeter, and I ordered the gold. Um, it comes in a pack of two. So I am going to try to attempt, and I hope I do, do not slaughter this, um, <laughs> my planner. So it comes with the two, or it comes with four, but um, for these in there, and um, does it unscrew? Oh shoot! Yep, it just unscrews there. So I am going to go ahead and try to drill out these. I have a three sixteenths inch drill bit here. And um, so I'm going to start it. Oh, and then I also got um, this adhesive uh, for the, because um, I am actually going to have to cut my Filofax. So that's what I ordered. This is also off of Amazon. I'll link um, these products below in case you guys are interested, but I don't know how it's going to turn out. I'm kind of nervous. This was my very first, I mean, planner, like expensive planner that I've ever, that I ever bought. And it was probably, I think I got it like, I don't know, eight or nine years ago. So, I mean, I love it. I just don't, I hope I don't ruin it. So, I am going to start by drilling this and I will fast forward through this so you guys aren't bored with the um, Turn it around. Okay, still not yet. Let's see. assisted by my husband's hand here so that's nice thank you honey That's what it looks like and now I'm going to cut along here and pull this out to put this in just like so I'll be right back okay so this is how it turned out it didn't I never used this I never cut my planner at all um, this is how we did it. It is installed and it is nice and secure and it doesn't move because my husband drilled the inside here 
and put these, which is those, um, sorry you guys, <laughs> my arm, um, put these, which is right here, and drilled it all the way through. So I do have the two, um, oh my gosh, what are they called? I have these two rivets or screws, I guess, showing, but he thought it was a really bad idea to cut the leather and to take out that inner part because then it would just kind of slide back and forth. This way it is really secure and I can change out these anytime I want to different colors. I could go rose gold or silver if I want and then it'll just be different here. So that is um, that is the changing of these rings. If you guys have any questions at all, and then I will do um, I will do an updated planner a flip through with these new rings in here. And like I said, these are the thirty millimeter um, Moterm. Um, right there, that's where it is. And then I will. Excuse me, I will link everything down below. I will link this stuff too, even though I never used it. Um, I'm still going to keep it. I'm not going to send it back because I'm sure I will find something else to, to craft with. So I'm going to keep that. But that is, that is it. So my binder is not cut or tore. Um, it's not glued. It is actually really, really secure. And, um, yeah, like I said, just the back of it, I'm going to go back, I'm going to go over it with my, um, leather conditioner, but that's what the back looks like. It just has the two rivets showing, which I don't mind at all. And that is it. So I hope I explained everything okay. I know it's kind of choppy in different sections, but, um, yeah, if you guys have any questions, just let me know. Thanks for watching. Bye.